Hello, I'm Gus. And I'm Lou. Welcome to our YouTube channel. We're going to be showing you some of our techniques and demonstrating some of our work for you. Don't forget to press like and subscribe. Hello, this is the Haast's eagle and it's the only real uh, predator, I say is, it was. They're, they're both extinct birds and this is a, a symbol of Haast's eagle found in a cave in New Zealand. So it's a cave drawing but it's a beautiful representation of this huge bird which was probably the largest eagle on the planet, where the largest non-flying bird was, was roaming around. So of course, that's why these two are in, in this painting. Um, this bird was so big, it could attack a bird as big as a mower, um, being, <laughs> Mower could be two and a half meters tall, a very heavy flightless bird. And the eagle, of course, the extinct eagle, which was called Haast's eagle, um, I think he was an Austrian. Um, and the connection with Austria is quite interesting about this time when they discovered these bones of, of Moa, which M-O-A, um, Maori word for, for this bird. Um, around about the 1800s, they started to discover the bones of, of a bird uh, that could be three meters tall. And everyone said, well, it's pretty much impossible that this is a bird. But scrutiny of the bones soon revealed that it was a bird. And um, then they started discovering huge amounts of bones of this bird and many of them ended up in the Vienna Museum because um, the Austrian naturalists and scientists who were um, traveling to, to New Zealand were bringing back huge skeletons, whole skeletons of this bird and still today there's, there's um, moa skeletons in the Vienna Museum. So in New Zealand there were basically only birds and a whole huge landmass full of forest and, and birds. When Captain Cook arrived, he came was in the 1700s, when he arrived and anchored offshore, the whole crew was astonished to hear this massive sound this tsunami of sound coming from the islands and all the birds waking up and producing this great cacophony of sound from their, their dawn chorus. It was, it was an amazing, and they were well offshore hearing this noise. And that must have been a great uh, shock for them to, to hear.